All right, guys, um, I'm going to teach you how to sync an iPod Touch to iTunes in Windows 8 because in Windows 8, when you plug in your iPod, it doesn't automatically start syncing to iTunes. You have to do a little fancy work to get it to work. So I'm just going to plug in the iPod to show you that it actually doesn't work. And it does bing, and it does connect, and it does start charging. However, in iTunes up here, it does not show up to start syncing. So... What we're going to have to do is first you're going to have to unplug the iPod and then you're going to have to close out of iTunes so everything is closed. Then you go to search and type in CMD and not settings, apps and my bad, yes, run right click, advanced, run as administrator because you're going to need to run it as administrator for what we're going to be doing. So here you type in net stop Apple mobile device, and that'll stop immediately. And once that's stopped, plug in the iPod to the computer. Once it bings and shows it's connected, you do net start Apple mobile device. And it'll take a second for it to start. And now it's started, we can minimize. And we open up iTunes, and up here, if we look, it is connected, and it is syncing. So yeah, that's how you sync an iPod Touch to iTunes in Windows 8. Uh, I'm not sure if it works for other types of iPods. I don't have other types of iPods, but you're welcome to try and let me know. Alright, thanks.